Halloween, babe. It is. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. We're what getting a... our table ready for pumpkin carving. Mm -hmm. So we had about six pumpkins outside, and that today is a really rainy day. So basically, um, all of them got completely soaked and muddy, and we just had to wipe off two of them. So the rest are just outside. The poor, poor little souls. Poor little souls. You want to flip the screen around so you can see what you're doing? You did that, not me. Oh, uh, okay. But yeah, there was six pumpkins outside. We were only able to save two of them because they're all mushy. But it's Halloween. I have Nightmare on Elm Street 3 on. And I got my Freddy Krueger sweater on. And I got a Nancy pin on to celebrate Halloween. So it's a very Freddy type day today. Hi, Frankie. Happy Halloween. What's your costume? He's a dog. Oh my god, that's such a good costume. <laughs> hey. Hello? Are you okay? <laughs> I'm afraid that I'm gonna ruin it. Well, our knives are really bad. <laughs> yeah, we have very dull knives. If anyone ever tries to murder us, we'll be like, why won't this knife puncture your skin? Yeah. Well, pumpkins are done, babe. That was really easy compared to what we've done in the past. Yeah, like before we've done like a Freddy Krueger pumpkin. We did like <laughs> a Sam from Trick or Treat pumpkin. Frankenstein's Monster. Um, Frank from Donnie Darko. And then last year I did something that said Trick or Treat. Like I actually carved out the words. Yeah, pumpkins, like... These are actually a lot more fun to do and less time consuming. Yeah, they're than less the stressful, a lot less time consuming. We had fun. Yeah, yeah. That was much quicker than I anticipated. Yeah, so. my hand doesn't hurt. Mine does. Normally, really? <laughs> yeah. Well, your pumpkin was a lot bigger. Yeah, my than pumpkin's mine. a lot bigger than Kelly's, yeah. but we made this, some made some cute faces. This is Jackie. Jackie. Yeah. And this is Roderick, I guess. You look so cozy. Look at those socks. Trick and treat. It's upside down. Is it really? Yeah. Whoopsie. That's okay. So, how are you liking this Halloween? I love this Halloween. It's very different from all of our other ones. Yeah, I feel like we've had some pretty eventful Halloween since we've been together. And then he went back to the house and he kissed his wife and his two children goodbye. And then he proceeded. Where are we? Uh, uh, oh, uh, oh my gosh. We haven't even told them. Do you want to tell them? Well, we told people on Instagram. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, we... The, so, go ahead. I was just going to say, so if you follow us on there, you already know. And you saw their epic engagement. But mm -hmm. we had a Halloween housewarming party. And right before everybody got there, we were taking pictures in our costumes, which were... Frankenstein's monster. We'll ins insert some pictures here. Mm -hmm. And Bride of Frankenstein. And Brett was like, here, sit down in this chair. And I thought he wanted to do like a crazy pose or something. Like I thought he was going to like sit on my lap yeah. or something. <laughs> totally unexpected. And then he got down on one knee. So now we're going to get married. Yeah, it's hard to see because the lighting in here is not so good. But yeah. I'll insert some photos. It's so cute. It's a black moist night gemstone and it has little skulls on it so it's perfect for us yeah it is very perfect yeah so this is just a nice halloween we're just being very cozy mm -hmm. just relaxing at home we took the day off because i don't know how the viewers out there feel or just bobby who watches our content or just the one person who watches Bo our hey content. bobby <laughs> hey bobby we like the do you know that meme that bobby meme like no. for bands there's like a, there's like a funny meme where it shows like a band performing, and there's only one guy in front of the band. It's like we'd like to thank Bobby for coming Aww. out tonight. <laughs> so yeah, it's been a pretty cozy day. Um, it's very rainy out, and we're just waiting for trick or treaters. So I've had the first Nightmare on Elm Street on, and then I have Dream Warriors on right now. So eventually. Uh, 
I don't know. I'll put on another spooky movie. I don't know what that is, though. Trick or Treat or Halloween or... Uh, gotta watch the last episode of Creep Show. Yeah, it has to be obligatory. Is that a word? You'd, yeah. Um, yeah, Halloween type stuff. Yeah. I mean, we do this type of stuff all the time. We watch horror all the time, but... We typically save these ones for... Yeah, you have to watch... To me, the, the necessities is Halloween... the original or trick or treat it's like one of those two you have to watch the day of halloween so we haven't this year watched not to be nerdy but hocus pocus yeah we, we haven't uh, watched that our, oh we had it on at our party in yeah the our housewarming i just kept like putting like spooky but not scary movies like family like, movies yeah because there was kids at our party so. oh my gosh whenever we were watching beetlejuice and it was like everyone's just talking, and then out of nowhere, Penelope screams at the top of her lungs <laughs> because the Beetlejuice monster, like towards the end, the snake, mm -hmm. I think, came on screen, and she was like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. Yeah. yeah. So, I mean, and. Look I how cozy. Ah! <laughs> oh, Franco, we have a trick or treater. You want to give him candy? And go say happy Halloween. Outside, there's a tornado. Watch out, me. Here you go. Only one. <laughs> yeah, like we started off the beginning of the month wanting to do a scary movie every day, all the way through October. So we did pretty good for like the first week or so, mm -hmm. and then we really slacked off, but. Sometimes life just gets you really busy, so we weren't so good at uh, continuing that because yeah. we we had so we wrote down like a ton of horror movies on little pieces of paper, and every day we would draw one and we didn't know what it was and then whatever we picked we had to watch, so we kept that up for about a week. But you know, just I get home at like nine o'clock some nights, so yeah, light like life gets in the way sometimes. Halloween pasta. That's what we're eating tonight. Yep, we're gonna make some mm. in a little bit. Spooky. Even we haven't done a ton of videos lately, but that's, that's my fault. No, I mean, and plus it's just like I like doing videos with Kelly. Like I do some on my own, but it's not nearly as fun. Yeah, I miss it a lot. But I'm in grad school, and I work full-time, and I'm doing a full-time internship, so it makes things really hard. It's tough to, you know, to balance all that, and, you know, we believe in, you know, taking care of yourself and, you know, your brain, and, you know, there's times you just need to turn your brain off and not work on anything. Mm -hmm. and yeah. So, I think that's an important thing. But we do miss you, Bobby. We miss you, Bobby. So, <laughs> yeah. I don't know. <laughs> just some, just some thoughts. On, updates. Uh, and updates on the channel. So I always keep up with Instagram type stuff, but it's a little easier. It's much easier to do Instagram stuff than make YouTube videos. Yeah. Yeah, I pretty much get around to doing, or at least editing videos, like you know when I can, when I have a day off or whatever. Yeah. So, but yeah. <laughs> hey, Chef Brett. How's it going? Hey, Chef Kel. How's it going? Check it out. We got some Halloween pasta kind of finished. Mm. So it's, I'm guessing those certain ones are like spider webs. I'm having a hard time making out the other ones. Pumpkins, jack-o'-lanterns. Looks good. Look at our two pieces of garlic bread. And going star crazy today. Definitely. Some of our creepy decor. Mm -hmm. And... We have these beautiful skeleton hands. What do you call these? Salad tossers? Oh. Tongs. In our Ray Dunn trick or treat salad bowl. I'm gonna toss the Caesar salad. BRB. Are you having a nice Halloween, Frank? 
What would a dog horror movie consist of? The owners not being there. Or like the mailman killing their owners. Yeah. Just anyone they don't know where they can clearly tell they're not invited to their house. Or like house. a dog food monster. Yeah. There'd be a lot of home invasion movies that yeah. dogs would be scared of. Yeah. I think. And I'm not a huge home invasion fan. I am. Because that's like one of my biggest fears, so. Yeah. That's why I was so fascinated with the Golden State Killer. Mm. Chaser, chaser, chaser. Chaser, chaser, chaser. Oh my god. Okay. Everybody, take a second to look at this picture. This is baby breath. Stop. What? Stop. what? Like, there's very few movies, like home invasion type movies, that I'll be like, that was good. I don't know. Like, there's so much stuff that's so far-fetched, and you're like, just for the sake of the movie, it's like, oh, you gotta have that fake out, like, the person almost got to the, other, the upper hand on the, the bad guy, but then they F it up by doing something really dumb. Yeah. And it's like, I mean, like, there's stuff in real life where you're like, yeah, like, that, like, I would mess up and do some like do something dumb right but there's stuff in movies you're like there's no way i would do something that stupid mm -hmm. in that situation but that always happens in home invasion movies what's your favorite one what's the one that doesn't bother you the most home invasion movies yeah um i actually made a list and i want to make a video of like 10 what i call decent home invasion okay movies. that's a good video yeah. good boy get it Good boy. And a lot of them had to do with where it was like, it was a home invasion movie, but not, that wasn't the only thing to it. Mm -hmm. Like, I do enjoy Your Next. I knew you were going to say that. Your, well, Your it's Next so is, good. it's one of those movies where at first you're like, oh, this is just so typical home invasion by the numbers. But, but then, it's not. But then, yeah, halfway through, it flips everything on its head. And I want to watch that. Yeah. And... Um, the Guest is a great home invasion movie. Oh, you right? Yeah, no, I, I gotta go. Mm-hmm. That one's really yeah, good. That's probably... I okay, would, don't tell them all. We should do this as a separate I video. Know. I would say, but to narrow it down, I would say The Guest is probably my favorite home invasion movie. That's great. Yeah. That's on our list today. Yeah. But I don't know if we'll get to it. We'll see. Babe, isn't it unlucky to have the umbrella open in the house? I would say so. Maybe we should. <laughs> I don't think. Shut it. I don't think you can shut it like that. <laughs> we might. It's a that, little windy. Yeah, that needs some uh, repairs. It can still like cover some. Right? <laughs> <laughs> it might blow you away in the process. <laughs> yeah, that needs some work. <laughs> So wow. that's your attempt of taking Franco out for yeah. to go to the bathroom. I mean, I try to go out without it, but it's so it's raining so hard. Mm -hmm. So yeah, so this is the reason that it is now what seven fifty five probably at this point. Look at our candy. Look, pop. we okay. have had literally zero yeah. trick or treaters. This is the first time for me. Yeah, this is the first time for me too, and this is the first. You know, we moved into this house in July, yeah. so our first Halloween here, we had zero trick-or-treaters, and that's yeah. really sad, actually. But it's the first Halloween where we've had a tornado wash in the state of Maryland, so... Yeah, I guess we'll try to look on the bright side of this, but at the same time, maybe we should uh, name this video an unsuccessful Halloween. Because, yeah. I mean, we had a good day. Today. Yeah, I love today. Yeah, today was really nice, but I mean, the thing I would change is if we, even if we just had that one trick or treater, I think it would have been a good day, like a really great day. Yeah. But I guess I can't complain too much. I'm just giving you like multi purpose as a fan. I could. Are you hot? A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Are you gonna go into uncontrollable laughter? <laughs> I think we need to throw this away. Is it really beyond repair? Baby, are you kidding me? 
Look at this. Look at this. Beyond repair. Oh. Oh. Well, look at this. Hang on. It extended? Okay. Actually, I don't think it's going to work. It's not. Yeah, even going back to its normal state. It's, oh, it's really sharp. Yeah. All right. Well, yeah. Let's go make Halloween pasta. Ooh.